All right, now I got to be a little bit faster because I got to get right to it. But this is another part of measurement word problems. Um, this is a word problem we're going to start off with. Suppose you had a rectangular room that was 9 feet by 24 feet wide. Well, what is the room uh, in square yards? Or what is the area of you in square yards? But notice that said feet by feet. We looking for square yards. So that means, but you got to convert Use your conversion factors for both of these. So nine feet, and we know that three feet is one yard, and feet got to cancel. So nine divided by three is three. So you can shove this in here. This is one, and then the nine divided by three is three. And then your feet cancel, and you got yards. So three, three, so nine feet is three yards. And likewise, 24 times one yard by three feet, and then uh, one yard over three feet, and then 24 divided by three is eight. So 24 feet is eight yards. But we want square yards, so yards by three yards by eight yards is twenty-four yards squared. So that's how that problem works, because you gotta uh, multiply, find the area, which is multiplying length by width. But this one is twenty-four cups equals how many quarts? We need to fill in what goes in this box right here, right? How many quarts? Well, twenty-four cups, right, is what they're giving you. This is what you're given, and you know that we can change cups to pints, and the cups gotta cancel. So that means one pint, two cups is one pint, and two pints is one quart. So that means twos are down here, but these twos you can put together and make four, right? Four going to 24 six times. That's why six quarts left over because the pints cancel and the cups cancel. So that's how you do this problem. So six will go right there. All right, what about a rectangular poster that's three feet by two feet? Well, we want to know what it is in square inches. Well, three feet is 36 inches, right? And then two feet is 24 inches. So we're really looking at 36 inches by 24 inches. Or 36 times 24, which is 864. But since it's inches times inches, that'd be inches squared. So x 64 inches squared. And that's your lesson right there for 8.1. And I think we got one more piece, one more part left. And that's it, man. 8.1 is done in a nutshell. Math made quick and easy by Mr. P, your Math 020 professor. Peace out. Have a good one.